Take a look at these structures up here. This is what they're going to do to cut down on traffic problems. MDOT has shipped in this. It's a giant version of a children's toy. The Screaming Serpent is quite possibly Las Vegas' newest roller coaster. It's a little smaller than most. It went from a box of parts to a working thrill ride in just seven hours. The hardest part was getting a frame built, and then doing the track was a lot easier. David Dorian works at the Hobby People's Shop. He built this out of Connects pieces. Connects are plastic, and uh, Erector sets more metal, and you use screws and um, bolts. Other than that, they're pretty much the same. It is the same concept going into this temporary bridge that they're putting up over US-95 at Valley View. Take the parts, slide them into the slot, just snaps right together. A little bit more technical than that, but basically, yeah, just like an erector set. See the giant metal pieces? Well, think of it as a giant connect set. But this set is 210 feet long. Altogether, the pieces weigh 84 tons. It's strong enough to drive over all day long. What they do is they'll put a piece in the place, bolt it up, move like prefab the bridge, to pick the whole bridge up and put it into place. Back at the hobby shop, Barbara Shepard isn't too sure about going life-size with this stuff. In olden days, they did it, they used screws and bolts. Now it's like Legos, you snap them together and you send people across them. Do you think it's safe? The contractor building the bridge says it is. They've done this many times before. Plus, it eliminates a detour, unless you prefer detours. Some old-fashioned screws and nails. Screws and bolts. Cement and now, if you want more information about this project, if you want to look it up at home, there's a website on your screen. That's our website. It's yourinsidelasvegas.com. We put a link on there, so if you click on link seen on News 13, you will get right to that information. Now, more information about what is happening right now. Let me show you what is happening here on 95 Southbound. We've heard there is a three-car accident just around this area near Valley View.